Chris Hemsworth needs to do more movies like this. Hello, welcome to Just My Thoughts. I'm yours, Khalil Ward. And on this episode, I'll be talking about Extraction, the new Netflix movie. It just came out. I had to check it out. It is written by Joe Russo. Yes, of the Russo brothers who directed Avengers Endgame and Infinity War and Winter Soldier and produced 21 Bridges. He wrote this movie and is starring Chris Hemsworth of Thor fame. Um, he's a mercenary and he gets called into this job that's super dangerous, but he he wants money. He, he's doing it for the money. He's kind of depressed. Um, he's lost some people close to him. He has like these these dreams but you don't get to see like who's in the dream. Um, but he's just this mercenary that just, he all he cares about is the money. He doesn't care how dangerous the mission is. Uh, it takes a little bit for us to get introduced to him as a character. We we start off on this with this kid. Um, I think his name is Avi. And he's just trying to have fun with his friends um, after school. And he gets kidnapped. Turns out he's a gangster's son. And this particular gangster is from India. But he's in prison and the guy that's in prison, he's like, yo, go get my son back. He tells the the person that was supposed to be watching him, you know, I want my son or I'm going to kill your family. Turns out his son was kidnapped by the biggest drug lord in Bangladesh. So they ended up getting Tyler and his crew to extract the kid. And I must say, wow, Netflix, nice job, nice job. Round of applause for Netflix for um full movie you know i enjoyed everything about the movie um it, there were slow moments in the beginning you know when we get introduced to the characters and stuff but once chris hemsworth goes um to bangladesh to to get the kid it it picks up there's nice hand to hand combat fighting sequences that i'm not used to seeing hemsworth do you know as thor he's it's, you know it's a lot of green screen and a lot of slow motion stuff and this one he was fighting like really getting into it, it it had a, a John Wick feel at times because he would use a, a hand can, a hand a handgun at close range, different shots, different angles, and stuff like that. Um, but then it had the Bourne feel, you know, with him just beating people up. Um, there was an epic car chase. Um, there were moments like with the, the camera. I like what the, the director did with the camera in terms of there were moments where something would happen to a like particular character. And instead of the camera following what happens to that particular character, it will linger on another character and you will follow what they're doing. And then something else will happen off screen coming onto the screen. It, it was it was pretty cool. They did it a couple of times, you know, during that whole intense sequence where Hemsworth is really trying to get the kid out. and He's killing a lot of people. Um, of course, things don't go right when he's trying to extract a kid from this drug lord's place of business the the guy controls everybody all the cops and everything he shut down everything so they could they couldn't it was hard for them to get out and it was it was intense um you have the 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 quiet moments with Hemsworth and the kid you know when they talk and they they learn about each other and you know and they have that that I don't want to say bonding moment but it was it was a bonding moment you know Hemsworth don't really like care about the kid as much but it was it was a cool quiet moment um Got an appearance from David Harborough. He comes in the movie about an hour in, which was good seeing him as well from Stranger Things. And it was just, it was fun. It was a really, really fun Netflix movie. You know, a lot of action. Again, some quiet moments. And it was just cool seeing Chris Hemsworth let loose in terms of just, he's a big dude and letting him fight and, and go after it. It was it was a lot of fun. It's definitely something you should check out this weekend. Um, Extraction, let me know what you think. Thanks for listening. Hope everybody's being safe out there. Deuces.